friends and sisters and welcome back to my channel if you guys haven't tell but haven't told can't tell by the title of the video the chaotic group chat is back for the fourth round of the trick or treat -a -thon. um if you guys haven't been if you guys are newer to this channel or maybe you just haven't like gone back and looked at my stuff um from the past my friends and i the chaotic group chat have been doing a like a halloween readathon probably I think I want to say like 2019 to 20 or 2020 and this is our fourth round now we have done a lot of things over the past three years we have done like the normal basic Halloween stuff we've done a slasher we've done spooky monster house with them classic monsters from classic era and this year we decided to do childhood shows so we're thinking our Teen Titans our Spongebob our That's So Raven or Lizzie McGuire and so much more as per usual we are going to be doing some fun we're doing nine prompts i'll get into the prompts in a second i think we are doing a bingo board this year um connor our graphic designer the group check graphic designer has not sent us i don't think the prompts yet but a bingo prompt yet so i'll leave a link to our instagram page we'll be doing a lot more of that stuff as well as the separate um hosts page which you guys can check out and peruse their content for your pleasure we are i think we are going to be doing live shows as we have in the past once a week throughout the month of october and i will be vlogging in october so if you, so you guys will be seeing two videos a week hopefully every week of october right now i think i have one week where i'm going to have a little bit of a, of a breather week and it's just going to be one video that week but so far i'll be vlogging every week of in october so you guys can see all the spooky books that i'm going to be reading so yeah let's get into the prompts very excited for this year we you, it's very nostalgic you guys would recognize a lot of the tv shows that we included lots of them vary from all different forms of our childhood and ground rules we've we've always been a very chill halloween readathon you can double up on books if you can find the one book to rule all the prompts you're welcome to um it's a very chill readathon we're not gonna do any crazy challenges one year maybe when we're like feeling really inspired to do them but right now we're just chilling like villains and we're trying to just enjoy the spooky season and really just enjoy it and soak it all up so let's get into the prompts so we can go ahead and discuss what we can and so we can go ahead and start planning and plotting for our TBR because I have started already. I have to include a book because I realized that the Sword Catcher comes out in October and for some reason I thought it was going to come out in November or next year. So now I got to squeeze something in there. So first I'm going to tell you guys the TV shows that we chose for and the episodes that we chose before I tell you guys the prompt exactly. So going down the list, Sweet Life of Zack and Cody, the, scare, the spoopiest one of them all, The Ghost of Sweet 613, love that episode. Powerpuff Girls, the Speed Demon segment, because you know Powerpuff Girls is broken up to like three, two to three different segments in each episode, so it's the Speed Demon segment. I think it's season one. I, y'all can find them. I believe Powerpuff Girls is on Netflix. Sweet Life of Zack and Cody is on Disney Plus. Then we got The Simpsons Treehouse of Horror episode, Treehouse of Horror 4. Again, also on Disney Plus if you guys want to start watching these guys. Curse the Cowardly Dog, King Ramsey's Curse, which is to me the spookiest Curse the Cowardly Dog episode out there. There's nothing sc scarier than a figure in the wind going, bring me the slab. As the entire apocalypse is unleashed on your house then there's the that's a raven don't have a cow episode disney plus lizzie mcguire the my fate one of my favorite lizzie mcguire episodes was the day of the living dead or the night of the the night of the day of the dead then we got spongebob's very legendary graveyard shift teen titans the haunted episode where it features slade and then Magic School Bus in the Haunted House. So those are our nine TV shows that we chose from, nine episodes. I rewatched most of these episodes to get in the groove of helping create prompts so you guys can see where we're all coming from. 
But starting off with Sweet Life of Zack and Cody, The Ghost of Sweet 613. This is just very basic read a band book just because you know they were banned from entering the apart the room because it was haunted, it was spooky, it was creepy and crawly so you guys are more than so go ahead and read a banned book. The second prompt is Powerpuff Girls Speed Demon which is read a book involving demons. Y'all got your pick of the litter. You truly do. I promise there's a lot of books about demons out there. Next is The Simpsons The Treehouse of Horror. Treehouse of Horror 4. Um, since this one is like a mishmash of different scary segments, again, we decided we'd read a short scary story, or read a scary short story, or if you want, you can read an anthology. I might be rereading, um, all of, or one of the books for, um, scary stories to tell in the dark. Curse the Cowardly Dog, again, the King Ramsey's Curse with Mr. Yeah. And that is read a book involving a curse. That's so Raven, Don't Have a Cow is going to be read a book with an animal either in the title or in the cover. Y'all got your pick of the letter. Lizzie McGuire is Night of the Day of the Dead. And if you guys don't remember what this one is about, uh, I think it was in the middle of uh, Latin A Heritage Month where we see Miranda um, display dead, the, the Day of the Dead stuff for like I think like a family fun cultural situation. But that is read a book by a Latina author if you guys would like. You got your pick of the letter out there. Pick of the letter. Then SpongeBob SquarePants, The Graveyard Shift. So y'all can read a book at night. I don't know. I think it's a funny. But I think it was a very apt. Next one is Teen Titans that is haunted. If you guys, this one I'm going to explain a little bit because I don't know how many people have seen Teen Titans. It is on Amazon Prime. So if you guys have Amazon Prime or have a friend or a buddy who has it, you can watch the episode. But it's um, where Robin kind of goes a little like obsessed with trying to find Slade and everyone's like no Slade's gone and he's like no he's not and then he starts hallucinating Slade everywhere. So for this given that it's on a set in a stormy night we have a character who's starting to lose some screws and all of his friends just very concerned for his well-being. We decided to go with read a gothic book like you know within the, the, the genre gothic you guys can choose a gothic horror any kind of gothic novel if you'd like you can choose um a like a gothic romance you guys have your you guys it's not like spe it's specific in the genre but the genre in of itself is wide so you have your you have your your choosing you ha you can choose you don't have to read a, a spooky care like gothic book you can choose a gothic romance and then the final book is the magic school bus which is in the haunted house and you guys can go ahead and read a middle grade novel or a children's book whichever one you guys want to do. And that is it for the prompts. I'm very excited for this year. It should be a very fun year. I'm always excited for every year. I like Halloween. But um, again, I will be leaving all of the co-hosts down below and it's going to be the usual. Um, we got Connor. We got Lisa. We got, I think Lisa's coming. I, we got Andre. We got TB, I probably. And then we got Armin and myself. And then we have our special co-host whenever she's able to make it and that is Charlotte from the original group chat. So, you guys got your shot to see what you guys want to do you got you you can have we'll have the bingo board out i'm assuming hopefully shortly i think I, if we are going to have a bingo board this year but yes join us in our live shows i think they'll probably be happening every sunday when we do do them um and yeah go ahead and get your tbr set up but until next time you guys see my tbr hopefully you guys are having a wonderful and spooky afternoon and yeah take care until then bye Thank you.